I think I sold our souls. Tour was fun, fing tasty. So it's June 14th, 2019. We're on the first show of the first leg of our tour, The Rum and the Reckless. At this point, our band released two albums, well, two EPs, Wake Up the Neighborhood and For What It's Worth. And we planned this insanely crazy summer tour all over Southern Ontario in support of these two albums. Detour Music Hall is a venue among legends. Kill the Duke. Other kick-ass bands, of course, and yours truly, we're the lineup. Drinks are flowing, music is cranking, such a good-ass night in the making, and a good-ass night it was, including, but not limited to the part, when my guitar kind of smashed the Neil's face, but I digress. That's a story for a different time. Now, our band Sundown Superhero is upstairs in the green room. Oh, I use that term very loosely, incredibly loosely, because if you've ever played Detour or been to Detour, you know by green room, I mean the section of tables upstairs, which is exactly where a band was sitting having some beastly ice cold beers and a friendly band game of King's Cup. I need to add that anyone who's been on tour knows properly that while there's a whole bunch of time on your hands, it still feels as though there's not enough time to do everything in which is pretty stressful so don't judge your boys for a few pre-show drinking games anyhow in walks jasper now this dude's name actually isn't jasper but one i'm obviously trying to avoid any potential lawsuits on my band's behalf and two i think it's a cool magician name the magnificent jasper and speaking of which, that's exactly how this man introduced himself to us, as a magician. Nope, not a musician, a f***ing magician. So, here we go. <laughs> hey man, you guys want to see a matter trick? I'll do it for a beer. Now I need to let y'all know, right? The contrast between Jasper's way of speaking and his antics are f***ing chalk and cheese. Cause this man speaks with a super laid back, chilled out, stoner vibe, right? But his antics are these twitchy, strung out, crazy, like if you toss a cat in a blender kind of, kind of antics. Anyways, Emil goes, Um, I guess so. Phil says, Uh, sure. And I'm, I'm with him, I'm just encouraging this dude. I might, actually, I was encouraging this guy way more than Phil and Emil were. Anyway, he's dressed in this worn, generic 80s hair metal band t-shirt covered with like a tattered, raggedy denim jacket. And he quickly snatches up the cards from our King's Cup table. Which, I'm not, I'm not upset about that because honestly, thank God, at this point we'd already pulled three kings and there was one king left and smack in the middle of the table was a tall red solo cup. just. A concoction of everything we were drinking that night so thank God for small mercies anyhow pick a card any card man just don't let me see it original right anyways I grab a card from the deck show it to a not so amused Emil and Phil and the rest of you guys okay dude pass that card back I oblige I gave him my card Jasper takes my card Jasper the magnificent takes my card Cuts the deck, puts my card in between the deck with a bunch of other cards, and proceeds to fully f***ing throw the cards straight over the balcony downstairs. Legit. Zero exaggeration. My man takes up the cards up over into the balcony, down into the crowd below. Not done yet, he drags this book out of his right jacket pocket and says, Your band man has got to sign my book. Every band that plays your signs it. And the light detector would later determine that was a lie. But anyways, again, why I do not know, but I encourage this man. So I grabbed the pen that Emil was using 
to write our set list down. Obviously, in between the waterfalls and thumb masters of King's Cup. But now, Jasper the fing magnificent declares, and I sh you not. <laughs> no, wait. You gotta use my special pen, bruh. Out comes a red ink pen from the left pocket of his raggedy ass jacket. I take the pen, best wishes, and God bless. Send down superior. I quickly scribble that down, or something to that effect. Now, my band is my witness. Jasper, the fing magnificent, snatches up his little book, asks for another beer. I think one of us gave him like a lukewarm beer on the table. He flies down the stairs, busts out the door, disappears into the cool, crisp St. Catherine's June night. Never to be seen again. Now, I'm standing here and I'm left feeling quite magically frustrated. And let me allow me to explain to y'all what magical frustration is. It's the same thing as sexual frustration, but for the people who aren't impressed with the magic trick that they've seen. Or the lack thereof in our case. It's literally fully the equivalent of you're about to get laid, but nah, you don't. Like I wouldn't even mind if this fing psycho had grabbed our money or pickpocketed us, but nah. Just the cards over the balcony, gets the signature, and runs off into the night. Why? I don't even know. Never seen him again. Anyhow, standing there, staring at the rest of my band, Shakiru, our touring guitarist, and Andy, our touring keyboardist, they got a general like, okay, I'm not sure what just happened, and I'm not sure what the f we just signed up for. Look on their faces, and Dara, our tour logistics manager, has this what the f just happened look on her face. But I'm left with my OGs, you know, my band OGs, Emil and Phil. Emil breaks the silence by saying, Craig, how do these people find you, dog? Phil goes to me, Oh, jeez. Pretty sure you just sold our souls, Craig. But with that said, we play our show, we killed it. We played the rest of the tour, we killed the rest of the tour, had the time of our lives. Like, I mean, we had a blast on this tour. Fly back to Barbados a few weeks later. I'm sat at a beach bar with one of my boys, you know, just reminiscing on the tour. Tour sound like a real, a real vibe. Bartender, who's also a friend of ours, uh, he's like, man, how was the tour? How did the tour go? Phil's words now pop right into my brain. Pretty sure you just sold our souls, Craig. And I go to the bartender, I say, tour? Well, I think I sold our souls. We're still not rich and famous, but tour? Tour was fun. Fantastic.